Hello guys and welcome to today's video where I'll be repairing this DJI Avada 2. Both front motors and the frame need replacement and to make matters worse, the entire bottom frame was absolutely drenched in glue which made the disassembly even more difficult than it already is. You see how you can replace your camera, the motherboard, the ESC board or the motors. At the time of filming this video there are very few spare parts available and luckily I was able to find motors and the bottom frame. You can find links for the parts in the description below and the first step as always is to remove the battery. If you are attempting to repair your own Avada 2 at home, make sure to remove all screws hidden under various pieces of tape and stickers. If something doesn't want to move, this might indicate that you missed a screw. Also, keep in mind that not all screws are the same length, so it's very important to keep them well sorted at all times. Before we move on with the video, I would like to make a quick disclaimer here. Normally this drone has four of these covers, but in my case one was missing completely and the other one was glued permanently. Regardless, the process is the same for all four. Furthermore, as mentioned at the beginning of this video, this drone was absolutely soaked in glue, so your experience will be different from mine. I had to cut off cables and scrape off a lot of glue, but you won't have to do this on your drone. Both front motors were damaged, so there was no point in attempting to save them.
after 30 minutes of prying and pulling and removing this hot glue I was finally able to remove the cables they are in these channels here here and here there is so much glue here and here and also these side panels are they're also covered in some sticky double-sided tape and don't forget whenever you want to remove the ESC board you need to remove this cable which goes through here there is a little slit and you should be careful to remove this first so you don't actually damage the ribbon cable absolutely awful design i cannot believe that this was made in such a way and it's basically made like it's never coming off ever again everything is glued into place all of these side panels here these little guards i don't know how to call them they are oh, both of them were glued in both front and back such a nightmare thing to disassemble well done dj now once i have this both of the motors are tucked inside the other cables are cut off as you can see here and all of this was to replace two motors i have the two new motors here and now it's time to solder
fully assembled to the extent that I can assemble it without the missing parts. Let's give it one more go and test if everything is working normally. Yep, everything seems to be working fine. Now that everything is assembled, it is time for a real test. So let's take it outside. Unfortunately, I forgot to charge the battery, so right around here it decided that it's time to go home and initiated a return to home. Anyway, thanks again for watching this video, I hope you liked it, and if you want to see me make future videos, don't forget to like and subscribe.